Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go again. Where nobody knows. What the hell am I doing? Uh, the better idea would go here. One second. <laughs> Holy shit. The good idea would be go here. To capitalize on the XP. But in some moment during the game, I gonna need to go here. But maybe it's not gonna be now. And no, it's gonna be now because this is... This people cannot do it here. So let's go here. And I want this trinket. Talking about trinkets, let's see what we have. AKA not much. So, you're gonna do healing. You're kinda a tank. Kinda. Bleed and bleed resistance. I'm about to change the two positions. Uh, the way it is is okay. We don't have anything to do blight with. In this position, you kind of do a little bit of debuff, but I don't want to do this. I'm going to give him a little bit of dodge, make sure. His speed is, a, well, kind of high, so we're going to be able to do this. Yeah, you're going to go without any equipment. I'm gonna change skills a little bit. You're gonna go with this. I no oh no, we're going right place. So here we're gonna do this. This time we're gonna take this one. And as always the big hill. You. You are now or fourth posi third position. So a pull is always a good idea. Let's unlock everything and upgrade what we're gonna use today. This need to go since he's gonna be our healer. A full back line is gonna be good. And go for a clear. Gonna gonna use this. So this is the three main abilities, and now we're gonna go to find the debuff. Dodger damage. We're gonna go on damage. And make sure we don't. If we can not heal so much, it's gonna be good. On you. Bone Spear. You're our second position, right? So you're not gonna be able to do Bone. We're gonna take this. A little bit of sustainability is not bad. This to take. Sh no, you cannot. So it's gonna be. So now is this what we can use from the second position? So it's gonna be this. Why are you going to be a little bit different? This one is a, I do like this. I'm gonna keep the marking to do a little bit of a damage on him. It's kind of bad, and we're gonna need to waste one turn, but eh, okay. And his healing is kind of suck because it's, it is a base, oh, it is a base supply on himself. But there's stress and I do not want stress. So we're going to take the heal to place this. A little bit of upgrade doesn't hurt him. We're gonna go for you, you, and you. <sighs> Make sure we don't want anyone else here. We have everything here, but we cannot even upgrade, so it doesn't matter. Trinkets are okay, let's go direct to provisions. Not okay, but 
we were working what we with what we have. One key. Wait. This is a one. Yeah, it's short, so we're gonna go with the two activations, three activations. Eight torches, okay. Two keys if we find the secret room. Two shovels, not gonna use shovels for anything. This for the buff. I'm gonna take one only. This for anything. And this is something that we do use. And this if we find the cure who takes a uh, faint. Fuck, I forgot to see if I left anyone in the sanatorium. Uh, okay. And I need to remember to change everyone's skills. Skill set. So the Necromancer came out. Talking about Necromancer on Diablo. I did a video. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. I know I record. I don't know if I upload. If this will come out before or after. They breed quickly down there in the dark. But perhaps we can slay them even faster. So. A healing. No, healing is going to be the last. This one, some of the horde because I like blight within, and this guy. You, let's take everything else. To we're gonna go with the buff first, and this, this, and this. We're debuffing damage, okay? You, we only go. Oh, you is already. We did fix you. And you, we're gonna take this one to place this. So we are ready to go. Yeah, I don't know if I told that before, but the guy who did this mod kind of fixed the problem that I, that everyone was having. So this mod back to the awesome and is back on the load order. Not hard code, back to the order. I'm uh, gonna go for this guy since I didn't do enough damage. I'm gonna try to kill him, and I didn't, but we're gonna do this. Now we probably kill everyone. Death by yeah. Inches. Remind yourself that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. We need, I think, his deeds the most right now. Is the priority. And in the end, this is gonna be a really easy run. We got surpri a surprise, so let's see. We're gonna go on the horde here, and we're gonna miss completely. It's fine, amazing. 10 out of 10, would miss again. They tend to attack mark targets, so yeah. Not good, not good, not good. Yeah, it didn't go well, so he's gonna be able to be healed. Cause this piece of shit heals everything, so fuck. Let's hope he heals this guy. No, he didn't. And heals and give protection. <laughs> That's amazing. Mark target. Confusion, nerves, and panic. Interesting. They keep it on the mark. I should have placed the one who marked target. That was kind of a mistake, but uh, fine. Gonna do the same on the other guy. Make sure the damage is a little bit low. Try to kill. We get one kill. Didn't get a blight. Try to the blight again, but we get a kill this time. This thing I think cannot bleed. Well, you can make. 
It's gonna be keeping pass because it's gonna do shit. Uh, you receive damage. You resist, that's good. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Oh, that's gonna be a fucking amazing one, huh? We're gonna go for the horde here. Uh, not the best, but work. Oh fucking K. Same style of thinking. Okay, he's probably dead. No. I hope the necromancer will kill it. Doubt it, but I always can hope, doesn't I? Don't I? Now you're gonna keep marking targets. Yeah, the necro didn't kill, not even close. So we're gonna do this and hope for the best. Continually onslaught, destroy them all. Holy hell, this pig is kind of have a lot of protection. Not so much, but he's still alive. Let's hope we land the blight, and we didn't land the blight. Great dodge from the necromancer. Slowly. Gently. This is how a life We're gonna try to land a blight here. We did, not enough to kill, but if I'm able to kill this thing, it's gonna be enough. It resists the bleeding, so we're gonna go for this because more damage and we got it. Surges as the enemy crumbles. As always, gonna use one of the keys. Success so clearly in view, or is it merely a trick of the light? Okay, we're doing well. Wealth beyond measure, awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Easy dungeon, placing everyone on a good level. Because really, the next fight on the garden, I never remember the name of the thing. The Baron fight is kind of hard, so we need to be very, very well prepared. And a personal tip: do not use anything who, any trinket who up the food consumption on any character. Fuck. Blow to body and brain. Diminished. Okay, he's dead with necromancer hitting this. He's dead for this guy. Still dead. Seven seven on the fucking top. And the guy dodged this. Why we keep doing this? I'm okay. I'm gonna do a me. Uh, everyone. Great is the weapon that cuts on its own. Oh uh, no! I'm gonna do a single heal. 
He resists, that's good, and... He's not dead and not gonna be, so... Give them no quarter. And you have full health, so it doesn't matter. As victories mount, so too will resistance. We're gonna okay. You're doing okay. Maybe if everything goes okay, we were able to do the two dungeons on this episode. Since this one is not kind of too big. Let's take you on first. We didn't. Maybe. We didn't. We're gonna go for this. Mark him so they're gonna probably attack him. We're gonna take the damage. Five is doing three. Let's hope for a two when we did. The slow death. Did six damage. Unforgiving. We did a miss, not the great. We gonna go for healing on you. Could be better, but could be worse. He's not gonna leave enough to be marked. The will to fight falters. Well, looks like he came over prepared this time. Maybe not. This is one of my the things I most hate about this mod. Yeah, use fresh meat on the fucking pig. It's not use on the giant pig, please. And I'm not even joking. Okay, we're gonna need a healing. Please miss. Please don't move. There is chance the guy's dead, yeah. He's going for 8 and 7. He's now dead, I think. Can make sure... His first speed he's 1, so yeah, he's kinda dead. Life. I'm gonna heal this guy. Hope we got a resist. We got. Next healing needs to go on you. I'm gonna delay for one healing on this guy. AKA on everyone. Inspiration and improvement. It's the next turn anyway, we're gonna go for marching on this guy. I'm gonna go for another healing. A time to perform beyond Can't do shit, I'm gonna go for a healing on him. Five full health, so let's finish this. This expedition at least promises success. Let's use the holy water. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. Yeah. I'm gonna go for him because, well, this guy after he gets his turn, he's kind of piece of shit, and I don't like repulsed. 
masterfully executed. I'm gonna use the ant venom because why not? And ah. he's gonna take blight again. No, he didn't. Thank God. Okay, he's dead. Now I can go just for him. Okay, I like this. Ah, uh, fuck. You're gonna be dead no matter what. Seize this momentum. Push on to the task's end. Last room. You got seven, seven, you. It's not quite early in the morning, but I did. I woke up very. There's not much time since I wake up. Goddamn the Necromancer pack. I play it like all night. Not all night, but until like 4 in the morning. So I'm really tired. How quickly the tide turns. I'm gonna try to farm him and set for him. And then I'm gonna start to do like the campaign. Cause I wanna see what changed. I did the first chapter entirely, the first act. And there was some dialogue that didn't quite fit him. Like the overall narrative of the chapter didn't fit the game. His dialogue options, so yeah. Let's take down your damage. He resists. Doesn't take damage. He don't die. Hit this guy. He did die. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Some experiments should have never happened. You are doing just work ending them. Windows and doors will be bolted. Tonight, something haunts the dark. Oh, fucking thanks. Ah, fuck, thanks. Everyone, I was fucking... 
spreading the curse to everyone else. I don't have a conqueror. Fuck, I don't have a conqueror and I want one. Hey, you know how much I need? I need fucking six. Yeah, why not? Give me my conqueror. Word is traveling. Ambition is stirring in distant cities. We can use this. Conqueror is one of my favorite classes. I don't know why, I just like. Well, release range excuse. Melee, everything's melee, really? Yeah, everything's melee, so doesn't give a shit. So let's see what we have for next time. Yeah, I don't kind of give a shit about Fnatic. I'm saying that because he didn't kind of fight him yet, so you can get. So we're gonna go for this one next time because I really like this trinket and I. Sometimes I roll two healers and having this and every healer is good. Let's already prepare next party. Since we got a conqueror, he's going to be going. Where are my conqueror? Yeah, I know, he's level zero, but wow. He's gonna be our second position. Our first position, aka. Because we're gonna go with our Jester as first position. Slash third position. She's not here for healing. He's not here to I'm gonna place you as our third position for a small healing bonus. And Avesto second position healer. Dangerous? Yeah. I do believe we can do it. But ladies and gentlemen, for now. I know I kind of think we would be done this in very short time, but I think he's a little bit more than what I thought. Yeah, quite. Ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for today. we going to... For today, no. For this episode. We're going to see you next time. As always, I'm going to leave in the description some channels. Then I would really like if you go and check them out. If you have anything to say, leave in the description. And... If you enjoyed the video, leave it a like. But as always, more than anything, thank you for put up with this interesting shit show. <laughs> thank you guys for watching from the bottom of my heart. See you guys next episode.